The proofing plugin is a great tool for selling photos to your clients because you can create custom products and make them available for purchase in galleries that you create. But what about when you need a client to submit a selection of photos without buying products? Like a pic of images so that you can do some post-processing work on the photos. Or what if you need the client to select photos for a custom photo album so you can create an album layout? Using the Collections tool makes for an easier workflow. Here's an example. Let's pretend I'm a client and I need to pick my favorites from my gallery and send them to my photographer. By default, Proofing includes a collection that we title Favorites for this common task. You can see here that several photos are added to the Favorites collection by clicking a little star button shown on each photo. When all the photos I want have been selected from the gallery, I can simply use the option seen here at the top right of the gallery view to send this selection to the photographer. Also, notice that I can clear my selections if I want to start over. I'll submit this collection of images and I see a confirmation that my collection has been sent. Now, as the photographer, an email will notify that the client has sent in a collection. Logging into WordPress, the proofing orders screen is used to review the submission. In this orders screen, the name of the favorites collection is shown right here in the title. The name and email the client typed in are also shown, as well as the name of the gallery, alongside links that are used to view or edit the gallery. Thumbnails of the images they've sent in are shown here, and using this button, I can click to view the details of each image. And look, there's even a comment left by the client for this image, because the gallery has image commenting turned on. There are also links to download individual images the client has chosen, a button to download all the images in this collection, a button to email a zip file of all the images in the collection, and this button to copy a list of the original file names. This button is a real time saver if you use software like Adobe Lightroom to manage photos on your computer. Copying these file names makes it easy to locate the originals in your library. Just paste them into a search box and photos with those file names are selected for processing, like this. This file name list may be pasted into other desktop software too for a speedy workflow. And when the collection has been dealt with, it's simple to mark the submission as closed. See our separate video linked here which goes into depth on this topic as well as product orders that you also see in this area. As we've already seen, proofing comes supplied by default with one collection called Favorites. A star button allows the clients to add and remove images to this Favorites collection. But what if you want to change the name of the collection of Favorites to, say, Album Selections? Or what if you want clients to add photos to multiple collections? The Proofing Settings Collections area here puts you in control. Type any name you want into this box and it will become the name of a new collection, which your visitors can see when working with their gallery. You can even choose to use the collection by default when you create a new proofing gallery. Or uncheck this box so the collection is not available until you check the appropriate box when you edit each gallery, seen here. You'll also find a group of icons to choose from for your collection. The icon you select will be used for the action button that clients click to add and remove an image. Many icons are available here by default and you can click this option here to fill in the name of an icon that you don't see in this list. By choosing from the Font Awesome collection, you'll have over 500 fonts to choose from to suit your specific needs. Type in the name of the icon you want here. You can choose to have the button appear on the gallery grid as a persistent overlay when you choose an image to add to a gallery, like this. Or select to have thumbnails appear only when the image is hovered on. The button also appears here in the Actions sidebar when viewing a single image of the gallery. Lastly, you can select the color of the button icons to match your branding. Go here to the Proofing Appearance General screen. 
and scroll down to find the Image Action Button Appearance box and change the color settings here. You may even change the opacity or show buttons as square. Collections are a flexible tool that you can use any way you want. When you need clients to submit one or more groups of images, but you don't need them to order specific products, try setting up a collection. Tasks like selecting images for post-processing or for building a photo album might be best suited to a custom collection. For more help, click the Info and Tutorial buttons you see up here in the software for details. You can also browse or search for help at our website or contact us for guidance.